Thank you for watching my video presentation on waste production management. There are so many ways to reduce the waste that each one of us makes daily. Did you know that each person generates 4.3 pounds of waste per day? This is approximately 40% more than was produced back in 1960. For my assignment, I have chosen to concentrate on decreasing my family's disposable waste with an emphasis on plastic bottles and styrofoam cups, as well as monitoring the amount of water our family uses. I began tracking this information from February 14th through March 15th. But before I present all my data, please watch a video I put together on the dangers of plastic and the environment. Data released by the United States Environmental Protection Agency shows that somewhere between 500 billion and 1 trillion plastic bags are consumed worldwide each year. Less than 1% of bags are recycled. It costs more to recycle a bag than to produce a new one. There's harsh economics behind bag recycling. It costs $4,000 to process and recycle one ton of plastic bags, which can then be sold on the commodities market for only $32. Then where did all the plastic bags go? A study in 1975 showed ocean-going vessels dumped 8 million pounds of plastic annually. The real reason that the world's landfills weren't overflowing with plastic was because most of it ended up in an ocean fill. Bags get blown around to different parts of our lands and into our seas, our lakes, and our rivers. Bags also find their way into the sea via drains and sewage pipes. Plastic bags have been found floating north of the Arctic Circle near Spitsbergen and as far south as the Falkland Islands. Plastic bags account for over 10% of the debris washed up on United States coastlines. A plastic stew twice the size of Texas has formed in the Pacific Ocean. Scientists have dubbed it the Eastern Garbage Patch, and its volume is growing at an alarming pace. With plastic particles outnumbering plankton 6 to 1, it's inevitably entering the food chain, of which you and me are at the top. Plastic bags do not biodegrade, they photodegrade. Over time, they break down into smaller, more toxic petropolymers, which eventually will contaminate soil and waterways everywhere in the world. Plastic, from large chunks to microscopic particles, have entered the food chain. The effect on wildlife can be utterly catastrophic. Birds become terminally entangled. Whatever happened to that bag? Did it end up here? Or here? Or even here? Nearly 200 different species of sea life, including whales, dolphins, seals, 
and turtles die due to plastic bags. They die after ingesting plastic bags, which they mistake for food. So, what can we do? If you use cloth or a recycled bag, you can eliminate six plastic bags a week. Why, that's 24 bags a month. And that equals 288 bags per year. Which translates to 22,176 bags in an average lifetime. If just one person out of five in the United States would use cloth bags, we could eliminate 1,330,560,000,000 plastic bags over a lifetime. Bangladesh has already banned plastic bags. Rwanda banned plastic bags in 2005. China has banned free plastic bags. Ireland took the lead in Europe taxing plastic bags in 2002 and have now reduced their plastic bag consumption by 90%. Modbury in Devon was the first town in Britain to voluntarily outlaw plastic bags in April 2007. Tisbury in Wiltshire decided to follow suit as of January 2008 with its residents agreeing to bring their own shopping bags. All 33 boroughs in Britain, including London, now support a bill to outright ban plastic bags. Alaska Australia, Israel, Canada, Western India, Botswana, Kenya, Tanzania, South Africa, Zanzibar, Taiwan, and Singapore have also banned or are moving toward banning plastic bags. In Paris, France, a ban on plastic bags took effect in late 2007. A nationwide ban has already taken effect as of January 1st, 2010. Norway is also discussing a blanket ban on plastic bags. March 27, 2007, San Francisco, California became the first American city to ban plastic bags. Oakland and Boston are also considering a ban. Plastic shopping bags are made from polyethylene, a thermoplastic made from oil. Reducing plastic bags will decrease foreign oil dependency. China will save 37 million barrels of oil each year due to their ban of free plastic bags. Please help solve a global problem by giving up this one little convenience. It is possible. You can make a difference.